Greetings music technology students. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to work with and change instruments that need to be transposed. So for your assignment you're going to be transcribing the wind quintet parts um, from the Obad by Adrian Barta and we have to make adjustments for clarinet and A and horn and ray. So typically um, clarinets are in B flat and horns are in F. So for example, we're going to go ahead and start a new project here. Now you can always create a new ensemble, but you can also just use what Finale has pre-programmed. So we're going to click on wind quintet, which comes with flute, oboe, clarinet in B flat, horn in F, and bassoon. Well right there is our first problem clarinet and B flat. We actually want clarinet in A. So you can go ahead and remove it and then we can add back in clarinet and A right here. But we want to keep it in score order. So go ahead and move that up. There we go. Okay. Uh, go ahead and click next. Oh, ask us if you want to save these changes to wind quintet. I'm going to say no because typically it is for clarinet and B flat. Okay, so our title is Obad. Adrian Bart. I'm probably saying that wrong, but that's okay. And you're going to transcribe it. So we're going to say transcribed by. Uh, no copyright. That's why I selected it next. Okay, so when you go into the assignment, the score is right here for you. Um, let's go up to the flute part because we know that flute is in concert pitch. Okay, so our concert key is three sharps, six, eight. The assignment requires you to transcribe 18 measures. The opening text is Andantino con moto. Okay, so there we go. So all is well. We've got flute and oboe in the correct keys. We have clarinet and la, but we still have horn and F. And as you look at the score, it needs to be for horn and re. Next one. So what do we do? Well, it's actually a very simple fix. By the end of our tran uh, adjusting, transposing the horn part, we need to make sure that base it's in the same key signature as uh, the clarinet. So right now the horn has four sharps and we need to get it with no sharps, no flats. So we click on window, score manager, and this pops up. Okay, so here's our horn part and this is the transposition. We need to get rid of those sharps by adding flats, if that makes sense. And so we're going to add flats. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do three flats. So as you notice right here, we are not in, the score is not in concert pitch. We can always change that, displaying concert pitch. There you go. But because you're transcribing from the original parts, you don't want it in concert pitch because the original part is in the transposition. So I hope that helps. It's a great tool, window, score manager, and there's all your parts. Um, you can also move your parts around. There we go. <laughs> it was there somewhere. Uh, so you grab these little lines right here and this is where you can move. So you can move them around. You can move bassoon up there, but that's not what we want to do. We want to keep it in standard wing quintet score. You can also add additional instruments. You can change the, the order of the score order based on various ensembles. You can change your notation styles, as I showed you the transposition, staff, clefs, all manner of things. Uh, the only other thing that we might want to do, or actually that we need to do, is go in and edit the name of this horn part, which really needs to be Horn in Ray. 
and now it's all set up for you to start transcribing.